Hey everybody, welcome back. Trailer reaction time. And today I've got a trailer I'm excited for and I'm definitely a little late too. But today we're here to watch the trailer, our first trailer, for the first look at season two of House of the Dragon. Show enough? Oh, not, not, not that drag. Okay. If you get that reference, you're really cool. <laughs> um, so anyways, we're going to watch this trailer. If you want to see it without my obscure ish references in the way there's a link in the description below or something's popping up right about now you can click on that check it out come on back watch me watch this and then we'll geek out over together because i'm gonna find a geek out worthy i understand game of thrones got very divisive i didn't mind the ending was it rushed yes it was rushed getting there but where they took things i'm fine with it i'm also fine with you not liking it house of the dragon i was a little eh when it was starting but man, that thing got really good really quick, and I loved that, and they ended on such an interesting place. It felt like, you know, Game of Thrones vintage. So I'm really excited to get in here and see what we're going to get from Season 2. And plus, anything that gives me more Matt Smith is automatically a win. So let's get to it. Let's watch. The Targaryen who sits the Iron Throne is not just a king or a queen. in an impossible position. All hail, King Aegon! The enemy have usurped my throne. We're going to King's Landing. Now, what are we going to do about it? We must play the board before us. Proceed cautious. Fuck dignity! I want revenge. News spreads through the realm. And the great houses will come to our side. I did not think they would be so eager to die. My ships sail at your command. The realm's only hope is in a leader strong enough to unite them. Do you accept me as your queen and ruler? This senseless war will send. She will now prevail. Not like this. I listen to us love for our enemy. That makes her a fool. The enemy without may be fought with swords. The enemy within is more insidious. There is more than one way to fight a war. a month all right i'm ready i'm ready to go um i will admit honestly i could use a bit of a recap i remember certain things certain characters i absolutely remember but there was a lot of stuff in there like uh yeah i kind of remember that person i kind of remember that person what was their story again what was going on there you know so obviously some storylines landed more with me than others this just looked awesome the dragon stuff looks so cool the armor they're wearing when they're riding the dragons is just so metal and uh oh there's a speed racer thing there god i love that movie um, random, sorry. Uh, oh, that, I can't talk about that on camera, but that reminded me, ooh, I had some, I had some creative breakthroughs last night on a project I've been messing around with for a decade. Uh, like major breakthroughs. Anyways, uh, let me get back to the plot here. Uh, House of the Dragon, it looks really, really good. I very much enjoy having a show like that to go watch with my dad. Um, and I love that it's weekly, so it gives us something to kind of go hang out after Sunday dinners and do. But, um, yeah, it just looks great. It just looks great. I think it's gonna, I know, I... I don't remember certain specifics of a lot of the storylines, but I know I thoroughly enjoyed season one. So I'm looking forward to repeating that uh, during season two, one hopes. But how do you feel? Are you on board? Did you ever give this show a chance? Did Game of Thrones just leave such a bad taste in your mouth? You're like, nah. Are you still all cool with all of it and enjoying the ride and being like, hey, listen, I just like things. Sometimes things are better and sometimes they're worse. 
but I just enjoy enjoying things like, like somebody like me, uh, let me know. Geek out with me in the comments. I'd love to hear your thoughts. Other than that, you can click the thumbs up button. Give me the good old thumb of encouragement as I do love to be encouraged. And remember that we will get through this. We will get through this together. All right. We like to say that together too. You know, little mantra thing, little power of positive thinking never hurt anybody, except apparently a couple of you got a little butt hurt about it, but whatever. <laughs> I don't know. I just want, I just wanted to say butt hurt. I just had the urge because I'm almost done being butt hurt in a literal sense. Cool. Um, random. Uh, Adult grape juice is kicking in. Uh, <laughs> where was I in my whole thing? Did we say it together? Oh, yeah, no, let's say it together because it works for some people. So let's do it. We <laughs> will get through this. We will get through this together. Okay, I may have said it three times. I don't know. Go check out my music. Listen to my music anywhere you listen. I'd really love if you give a few songs a chance. Get excited for some new stuff. I might try. I think I might try putting out a summer, a single, a summer single. And then uh, we'll have, should have the Mary EP part two out before the end of the year. I'm getting real excited to get started on that as everything is finally healed, healing. I'm almost completely done with all my stuff. I can focus on that. So I'm getting real excited. You can also go to ericbutts.com for all that funky butts fun you're looking for. And there's more with the links in the description below. So click that see more button to see more butts. And on that note, I'm going to get on out of here so I can go watch some more stuff. And I will see you all later.